In this tutorial, we're going to learn how we can copy course content from one course to another. An example of when I want to do this is I'm teaching the same course in the spring that I taught in the fall. So I can go into the spring course and copy materials in from the fall course. You note that this course is currently unpublished, so you don't have to be published to do this. You do have to have the same tools turned on in the new site that you had in the old site. For example, if you look in course tools, there's no tests and quizzes turned on, but I want to copy items from the tests and quizzes from my old course. So I would go to the site editor, edit tools, and just make sure that the tools are the same in the new course as the old course. So I'm going to select tests and quizzes, finish, and now that becomes available. If they're already the same, you don't even need to do that step. The next step is to actually import from site. So I'm in the site editor, I click on import from site, and it gives me three options. Replace, merge, or merge my users. The only one you're going to want to pay attention to is merge my data. So I select that. It then asks me what course do I want to copy from, and below is a list of all the courses that I have access to. I click on continue, and then it shows me the tools. This is my new spring course. I have a new syllabus, so I'm not going to copy that in. But I do want to copy in resources. I want to copy in assignments, tests and quizzes, and the gradebook. So you can pick and choose which uh, content you want to bring in. I'm going to click on Finish, and as soon as I do that, it starts bringing in the content. The copying may take a little while, depending on how much content you have. So now if I go to Resources in this course, you will see all the resources copied over. If I go to Tests and Quizzes, all the Tests and Quizzes copied over. And again, if I go to Assignments, all the assignments. Note the assignments come over as a draft, and you will have to go into each assignment and edit. That's because the due dates that you would have had set in the other course are going to be different, or assumed to be different, than in your new course. So that's the easiest way to copy your course content.